What's going on YouTube? It's Dizini. Welcome to a brand new video. Today, I got a couple new tools for you from Snap-on and I uh, picked up another thing, so <clears throat> let's check it out. All right, so the first thing I picked up was the Snap-on 497 ACF, neater nose, right angled, 90 degree pliers. I uh, have the long ones, so picked up the small ones. These do come in handy quite a bit. I uh, tend to grab my bosses, so it's like, let me grab my own. Pick these up. Uh, red handle, only one they had, so whatever. And then I picked up Snap on Butane Torch, Torch 400. Uh, I need to get some butane to fix it, but this thing's dope. This thing is actually, I thought it was gonna be made in China. It's not made in China, it's made in Ireland, I believe. Made in Ireland, so we got the 30 minute runtime, four and a half inch flame. 50 to 820 watts equivalent. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna get some butane, check it out. You got the nice big lock button. Click, adjust your flame here. I mean, it's just the overall, feels nice. Like this is a probably the nicest, you know, butane torch out there on the market. I mean, the, the aesthetics of it, the way it feels, it's nice as hell. I do solder and I do with the torch when I solder. So, and then I actually use the torch for, uh, Heating up, you know, if you ever work on valve cover gaskets, old and brittle, little butane torch, psh, heat them up real quick, get them nice and soft, pop them out real good, like we can burn them, they're not gonna use them. So uh, definitely a couple uses for this, uh, maybe heat up a boat real quick. I don't know how hot it might get, but it might help. I've never really used a, but I do use it on gaskets and soldering, so got that one. And then I actually uh, got this from a buddy is basically a block tester, combustion leak tester from U-View. And this one's a double chamber. I found out about the double chamber existing from uh, nuts and bolts with tone. So basically you have a lower chamber and an upper chamber. And what this is good for is if your fluid turns colors on the top one, then you know you have problems. Uh, just because if you use the original block tester, the single chamber, um, not too long ago, I had a Cadillac bad head gaskets and uh, it took me a couple times because it kept getting contaminated and uh, because it was building pressure way too fast and I just wanted to get it. I wasn't timing it properly to get the, the color discharge. So with this one, I don't have to worry. If this one gets contaminated, contaminated I'm not going to worry about it. As long as this one shows up um, bad, then cool. So pick that up. And I think this thing's like $60 on Amazon. I, my friend got this for me. So... I didn't have to pay for it. Dope. Comes with some block tester fluid. Nice little blue motor case. And comes with this little foam layout. So it's pretty nice. $60 on Amazon. I um, think it's a good set to get. Especially if uh, checking over heating work. Uh, I know some people like to use different methods for checking head gaskets. But this is quick and easy. Me, personally, I've never had one... Um, I think I had one where it said it didn't read properly. Um, it didn't tell me it had bad head gaskets, but anytime I've known for a fact that it's had bad gasket, this has proved it. So, um, I know there's gas analyzers and things, but <clears throat> we ain't talking about that here. I'm showing my new tools. So, those are a couple items I did pick up too. If you like this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Let me know down in the comments if you have any of these tools. Uh, let me know if you, any of y'all have that torch and how you like it, uh, if it works good for you. Uh, or if you think I just spending my money on a butane torch, let me know down in the comments. As always, if you want to see more, follow me on Instagram at is this any. I like to post daily of the vehicles I'm working on, as well as the tools I'm using. Thanks for watching. Y'all stay safe. See you in the next.